السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته it is July 2nd and I I was Santa Barbara seeing my friend and I drove back because you know I'm basically moving back to Orange County and in a way I said well I haven't seen Hamza Kito for couple of years now <laughs> and I knew that he works at the uh, Ford dealership here in Lancaster so I uh, you know drove my way over there and um, I saw that little man the young man he's a diesel mechanic at uh, the Antelope Valley uh, Ford dealership and we visited for a little while now I came to uh, the mosque here uh, the masjid on uh, L and 5 uh, uh, east of Lancaster, where that's where uh, uh, Belinda used to have the house that, uh, you know, after she moved out of Palmdale uh, from the family house. And uh, she, you know, mostly my kids were raised in, in Lancaster and that uh, my boys, Omar and Hamza, uh, at that uh, L Street house, or K, it's off K, between K and L. But anyway, uh, so I came to the masjid here, and this is really nice. I tried to uh, to get to Wi-Fi, but I need the uh, code, and uh, nobody here, and the administrator is not here. So I said, uh, let me do some videos. And uh, <coughs> I have some uh, reflections uh, about uh, you know what's been uh, going on. And again, it's uh, just uh, life, as beautiful as it comes and uh, there is uh, no regret because as I always say it is a process we wouldn't be the people we are today if we didn't go through what we uh, gone through so it's uh, it's everything is you know alhamdulillah for everything I'm very pleased actually in fact uh, uh, I wanted to go and thank everybody that uh, for for this experiences and life experiences and uh, and uh, trials and uh, you know tests that I uh, experienced and endure it was it actually it was a great thing because uh, I wouldn't know what uh, my strength uh, points are and I wouldn't know that I could survive uh, anything and uh, by being there seeing things and going through the experience, I it's it's I can just describe the you know the feeling uh, because it uh, uh, the the struggle itself well I wouldn't say struggle the experiences itself that it, it kind of uh, strengthen you and give you the assurance and the confidence that you are um, indivisible you can't. Uh, you have a lot of resilience it's just uh, you have to uh, we all actually equipped with that you have to 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 seek it you have to go through it in order to see that you possess all of that so uh, you know t you can eat anything you can sleep anywhere and uh, you know I, I'm, I'm talking about uh, this is only probably more so for men than women uh, or females because you know they don't have uh, well I, I don't want to I don't want to say anything to to uh, you know to minimize the of course they are strong and uh, they probably they have uh, stronger points and, and uh, gifts than we do have uh, however it's uh, you know the man always been the, the one that uh, took the rough and the the hard job, you know, going and uh, being out there uh, protecting and uh, working and uh, bringing the bacon home, <laughs> bringing the bread home. And uh, mom was, uh, her part was a lot more uh, important because she's the, the children, ra she raised the children, she loved, she nurtured, she uh, take care of 
of the man when you know prepare his food and do things and and she's actually her job is a lot harder than men because men just to get out there and you know they <laughs> they have uh, they work and they do all the fun stuff but uh, mom is the one got stuck home with the children and that's it's a, it's a very hard job and I know that because I've been a single dad for few a couple of few years I mean but uh, it's uh, it's a harder job to be a mom or uh, a dad uh, at home, not working mom or not working dad, than being working. And uh, 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 this is uh, facts. But when <coughs> when we have one parent, uh, doesn't matter a home or the children do their job, it's uh, much better than just having uh, daycare or the TV or whatever schools or what have you is the children because they will never uh, do the job that mom you know or dad do because they are not they're not they getting paid it's a job you know it's not some that is holy uh, and uh, and uh, you know uh, a religious or a spiritual obligation that we have to fulfill um, but um, yeah, anyway, I don't know why I got there, but this is uh, this is thoughts that I am experiencing right now. Yeah, we were talking about uh, the things that they got. It makes, it makes people a lot stronger when they go through hardship. And that's why, you know, the, the hadith, نَبْتَلِهُمْ بِالْمَصَائِبْ لُنُطَهِرُهُمْ مِنَ الْذِنُوبِ وَالْمَعَائِبِ And it's, it's, it's really... Uh, uh, very true, and um, I I lived it, and uh, I think anybody gone through you know hardship, they will uh, they will uh, testify and uh, agree uh, with uh, with the idea of uh, you don't you know uh, if you everything is handed out to you and you are working and you making money and you have your car and a house and a dog and a wife and the kids and uh, you don't really know what you're capable of because it's kind of you're programmed you're working in uh, autopilot it's you know and uh, most of the time we forgot forget who we are and we uh, we get lost within ourselves and we uh, we're just not happy and uh, things that we go through it makes us a better people and uh, it strengthens us and uh, I am I'm so glad that uh, I, I thank everybody I'm not gonna let anybody get away with with stuff because I have seen in uh, in, in, in the process I have seen the injustice and uh, I am not I don't care about what uh, you know what I get or not get it doesn't matter but I'm uh, gonna make sure that uh, I bring it to their attention, the authority attention, that this is our uh, violations and crimes are, uh, and uh, it has to be brought up and, uh, uh, and uh, investigated and do some about it, you know? I mean, do, you know, do some about it because it's not, it's not right because, you know, disparity and, um, and uh, the differences in, 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 uh, in the classes and the rich is just to devour the poor and keep preying on them and put them in, in, a, in a position that they will become a revolving or a, uh, an account that are making uh, money for their well beings. And uh, it's, not, it's not right. This is not what Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala created us for. He created us to love one another. وَمَا خَلَقْتُ الْجِنَّ وَالْإِنسَ إِلَّا لِيَعْبُدُونَ and the ibadah, it, it has many things, but most of it is the intention and the, 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 the love that you have for others and uh, standing up for the people that they can't stand for themselves. And this is, uh, this is what uh, I think I discover most, uh, more than anything else. I'll say this, and 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 I'll say this, and